Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Luke Ness Monster, and today we're going to be talking about some Star Wars The Black Series news. This is our weekly news update, the series on the channel that we do once a week, kind of covering everything on the Black Series news side of stuff that you may not have heard of, some smaller pieces of news that didn't really make headlines, but is still worth talking about. And real quick, before we get in the news, I did really want to make this announcement. If you guys haven't noticed, we actually got a brand new logo. I absolutely love this logo. I, I love the old logo as well. But this one is brand new, and it's great. But because of this, we will be swapping out our merch. Our merch does have the old logo at the moment, but we're going to be swapping that out in exactly one week. So if you are interested in some of the older merch, you have exactly one week to go and pick it up before it is gone forever. So if you are interested, make sure to go check it out because it will be gone. We're swapping out anything with that old Lugnus Monster logo. So that is, that's including the uh, uh, mugs t-shirts, uh, hoodies, even the uh, hashtag make tbs 5s merch. I love this merch, but the back of it does have the old logo on it. So if you are interested in any of this, make sure to check it out before it is gone forever. And real quick, we are also doing a giveaway at 8,500 subs, which is right around the corner. We are literally like 300 subs away, which is incredible. So thank you guys so much for all the reasons support. You do have to be subscribed to the channel though, if you do want to be entered to win this clone Captain Rex. Like I said, we'll be giving it away at 8,500 subs, and basically how that'll work is once we hit that subscriber mark or release a giveaway video, all you have to do is comment on that giveaway video to enter. Anyway, on to the news. So, unfortunately, there was not a ton of Black Series news this week, but we did see a ton of figures on sale because of Black Friday and Cyber Monday. Some of the biggest uh, deals we actually got were because of Cyber Monday that Amazon put up, but the funny thing is Amazon actually put them up on Saturday rather than Monday. Today's Monday, the day that we're uh, actually recording this and putting this out, but... Yeah, uh, Amazon did all of their Cyber Monday deals on Saturday, and they all sold out by the end of Saturday, and so there was no Cyber Monday deals left for Sunday or Monday, which was really strange, but I'll throw up a ton of the deals on screen. Uh, there are some great deals, like a uh, like a $20 Dark Trooper, which is normally a $30 to $35 figure, depending on where you buy it. So that is a great deal. There is also my personal favorite deal, one that uh, I would have picked up a, uh, picked it up if I didn't already own it. And that is the Mando, Grogu, and Ahsoka 3-pack for only $45. This was originally $66. So uh, about $20 off, a little bit more, but that is just an absolute steal for a set like that. You get Mando with his Beskar spear and also Ahsoka with her cloak. Both are exclusive to that set. And also a Grogu who's actually capable of holding the cup. So yeah, great set there. and I do highly recommend it. Unfortunately, it is no longer on sale. All of the Cyber Monday deals are over. But yeah, there is a ton of great deals. And um, you know, there's some of those deals that you'll never see again, at least for a long time. Uh, so yeah, it was just really cool to see some of those and um, those were some of my favorites. According to Yakface, the brand new Ned B figure from the Kenobi show is now hitting Target stores. This is a deluxe figure, which means it is not exclusive to Target or any other store, so you should be able to find this at any store that you normally buy figures at, Walmart, Target, websites online, fan channel sites, anything where you normally buy figures, this, sh this should be available, but uh, as of right now, uh, it is now hitting targets, which is pretty cool. This is uh, the first plastic-free packaged figure that I've personally seen uh, hitting stores. I mean, except for the holiday figures, but I don't count those. Uh, but yeah, pretty cool, and uh, if I see this in a store, I may just have to pick it up. There have been a ton of reports of the Target-exclusive Tibbin Station, Obi-Wan, and the and or uh, Ferric Stormtrooper or Ferric Officer. Both have been hitting targets recently. I actually found these personally at my target. So I'll throw up an image right now if you don't want to see. This was actually from my latest vlog. So go check out that video if you haven't seen it. But uh, yeah, these are hitting stores, which is great. I actually did pick up um, the uh, Tippin Station Obi-Wan. I already do own the Ferrix Officer, so I didn't pick up another one of him. But... Uh, yeah, these are hitting your targets now, so if you are interested, go check yours, and you may just get lucky. Now, thanks to Yakface for the heads up, but Target is actually running a sale all this week. They're doing a buy two, get one free on most Star Wars merchandise. This is excluding Legos, but I do believe this does include Black Series and Vintage Collection. So if you do happen to find some Star Wars merch at Target, uh, consider picking it up because... They do have a buy two, get one free, and uh, you can you might just get a free Black Series figure out of it. So yeah, go check out your targets, and uh, you might get some nice Star Wars merch. 
But uh, yeah, that is actually all the news that we do have for today. Like I said, not a ton of news this week, but this is just some of the stuff that didn't really make headlines. It's not super big, but it's still definitely worth talking about. So if you guys did enjoy, hit that like button and subscribe. Definitely hit that sub button so you don't miss out on any more Black Series news videos like these. And I'll see you guys in the next video.